Yeehaw, everybody. Today, we are going to try and lift a fingerprint off of a snakeskin. So this is very delicate. Uh, so we're going to use something a little different today. You saw in some of the other videos that I did, we used a feather brush with our fluorescent powders. Well, I'm going to use a feather brush, but I'm going to use a regular black powder because this is so fine. Um, I don't want to use my regular brush. So let's see what I can get with this. Let's check it out. All right, so a little bit of powder. I'm going to apply it the same. Um, still doing that twisting technique as I'm dusting. Mm. I don't know, folks. Let's see a little bit more. I'm adding more than I want to. Let's see what we got. I'll try the back side here. Easy. All right. So I I don't see much of what I'm looking for here. Let me see what we got. Mm, I don't really see a good print on it. I'm going to try to lift it and see if I can't get anything. So I'm using a gel lifter again because it's not super sticky. If I tried to use regular tape, that would probably pull this thing right apart. So I'm just going to use this gel lifter. Oh, made an error. I didn't shut my, my powder. Shame. That's a shame. Okay, so I'm going to take my gel lifter and apply that to my snake skin. Easy does it. All right, let's see what we got. Oh my gosh, we got it. These are great. I'm going to show it up here so you know I'm not BSing you, but I'll put it in for a close up. Holy moly. Will it fingerprint? Snake skin will fingerprint.